let's talk this one. This is my tiger pad. Had albino reticulated python, and he is the smallest of my reticulated. He's the youngest. So just someone asked before, how many snakes can I take out at the same time? And I said, it all depends. Um, right now, these three are quite manageable together, even though the retics move a lot. And he's, look at him now. He's been a little bit everywhere. Um, and then you'll see Pearl, who I had out earlier, is up on their little homemade playground that my husband made for them. She likes to be up there um, whenever she's out. She's a climber. Um, the retic, that one is a little too, well, I think he moves too much, but he gets on the bottom part, but he doesn't normally go up high on that, but all the boas go up pretty high too. So maybe I'll take one of the boas out tonight too. Um, the big one eight, so I can't take her out, but I'll take out probably Romeo, but yeah. This is my tiger pod, which some think is my prettiest retic. I honestly, although this is a pretty snake, think that the golden child, which is the female, she's in shed right now, so she's not even out. Normally, she's, she'll be out peeking, but because she's in shed, when she gets in shed, she gets real funky. She's actually in her hide. Um, hopefully, she sheds any day now, but to me, the golden child in this Motley Mochino is the prettiest. Um, although people like tiger pods um, a whole lot, but definitely a beautiful snake, but I just think the iridescence on the Motley Golden Child Sun is really, really pretty. And the same for the colors of <laughs> Cafe, which is my Machino Molly or Molly Machino. So, yeah. Now, this one moves a whole, whole lot. Um, but this is my son's favorite. Michael normally will come and actually get this one out uh, whenever he wants to. He really likes this one. Yeah, this is mystical. Say danger. All right, let's see who I'll get out next. <laughs>